What is up, me amigos? What are y'all doing today? Uh, today I'm gonna. It's gonna be a absolute beautiful day. Oh, I can't wait. We're gonna run this, run to the store real quick. I gotta get some stuff to finish up another video that I'm working on right now. Uh, and then we'll put, we'll get everything ready. We'll, we're going to, we're going to the river today again. Oh, I can't wait. It's supposed to be like in the 70s today. I'm pumped. We're gonna do a little bit of bass fishing, I think, if I can get up the cove. Uh, just stay tuned. And you old in with your hair in the wind, baby, without warning. I was doing all right, cause just your side had my heart storming. The moon went high and stars went shining. Rain was driving thunder lightning. My whole world when you came. It hit me like a hurricane. And now, safety tips with Jay Homie, starring Jay Homie. Hey, safety tips with Jay Homie. Jay Homie. How do you drive a tractor? First, you gotta what, Jay? Can't find it, grind it. I'll show you right. First, you gotta put it. First, you hit it up. Put your foot on the foot. First fish of the day, guys. Look at him. Old channel cat. Netted by my old buddy Jay Homie here. Fish number two, guys. Alright, guys. So after a successful day catfishing, you gotta come home and you gotta clean these things up and get them ready to eat. So I'm going to show you how to clean these fish. Alright, so first thing you do is you lay down a tablecloth. Cause boy, I tell you what, you don't want your mama mad because you got blood all over everything. So you lay down some old towels. That way you don't get blood everywhere. Alright, so first things first. I'm going to whack this old sharp fin off here. So that fin's eliminated. You keep your bucket over here to the side. Throw your scraps in. Alright. So, so I learned from this feather. I think this catfish and get it out of the way. I learned from this feather down at the lake. These catfish, you don't have to gut them or nothing. Cause I know you was wondering, Josh, 
why the flip are you getting these things in the house? I'm not. See this fin right here? You go a little bit behind it. Cut down. Just like this. You find its rib cage. You just saw all the way down it. Of course, it's a whole lot easier with electrical knife. You can, with just a knife, go ahead and run across his backbone. Hey, you quit moving over there, buddy. Hey, quit moving. Old George over here wants to keep moving. Look at that juicy meat right there. That fish is done. In the bucket. Alright. So let's fillet some of these. Let's, let's right here. Prime catfish right there. Big old juicy nugget. A little big old juicy nugget. That makes a lot of sense. Alright. Boom! So we'll bring old Ron John over here. Old Ron John's been basting the head a little bit. Ron John provided us with a nice fat little filet out of that. You throw old Ron John in the bucket. That's catfish meat. It's nice and yummy. Sushi! Woo! So yeah, we'll show you the next process that we do now. Get you a nice strainer bowl right here. Take that meat you just got up. Wash that meat nice and good. Get all the nasty stuff off of it. Mm. Gonna be some good eating right under, I tell you what. You want to wash your hands after dealing with fish. Wash your hands nice and good. Make sure you get all the blood and stuff off of your hands. Also, you want to clean the sink up. You don't want your mama mad at you. Or your girlfriend or stuff like that. Because she got blood in her sink. all cleaned up on the next part you get you gotta you gotta also clean this mess up right here you know you got your bloody mess from your fish you think you can lay your knife off to the side always always I mean always start from one side flip her over bring your sides up like that 
bring this over bring this over that way you don't spill nothing in the floor because that's awful that's some good quality h2o all right take your blades to cut your fish up with back over to the sink Guys, don't just throw your stuff in here. That way your girlfriend or your mama has to wash up after you. Just take your son's guns. Put it on hot water. Let the hot water run for a little bit. Now you get nice and warm. Alright, now let that hot water start running, and then plug the sink up, throw you some dishwashing liquid in there, ain't warm enough yet, yeah, we had a ball tonight, me and my buddy Jay homie went with, my buddy Jay homie, and Travis, we all went to the river and did some fishing, they didn't catch nothing. I caught two, which is always a good time. Oh, I wonder if I'm enough. We'll talk here in a second. Let's finish cleaning up. Let me fast forward this through you. Woo! That was fast. All right, guys. So that's gonna conclude my day today. I hope you enjoyed. We absolutely had a ball today and just goofed around, played jokes, <laughs> caught some fish, flayed some fish. It's getting asked for a better day out here in the Nerd Outdoors channel. But don't forget, if you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and let me know down in the comments what you thought about the today. And I know. The catfish cleaning and stuff like that wasn't really that good because i mean honestly it was kind of like a learning i've watched people do it before it's kind of like a learning experience for me and i thought i thought hey let's just record it and we did i mean we got some good little meat off of them two catfish they're pretty good size for you know around here but yeah just i hope y'all have a great day like always, y'all stay nerdy out there, my friends. Bye.